Now, let me see example 5. Find integral of e to the power of 3x over e to the power of 3x minus 1 dx. By using substitution method. To solve this question, we must see both numerator and denominator. If you notice that, differentiate of denominator, we can get numerator, okay, because differentiate e to the power of 3x minus 1, we can get e to the power of 3x times 3, okay. To take u as our substitution, we choose denominator. Why? Because denominator is more longer compared to numerator. Okay, so let u is equal to e to the power of 3x minus 1. So we differentiate with respect to u. We can get e to the power of 3x times 3. So, we modify to get e to the power of 3x dx. So, 1 over 3 du is equal to e to the power of 3x dx. Okay. So, our question now. Okay. From the terms of x, we can change to be terms in u. So, integrate e to the power of 3x over e to the power of 3x minus 1 dx. We can write okay, in the terms u, but before that, we modify the question first. 1 over e to the power of 3x minus 1 times e to the power of 3x dx. Okay, so we can get one integrate 1 over u because this one is our u, okay, times e to the power of 3x dx is 1 over 3 du. Okay, so now we can integrate with respect to u. 1 over 3, 1 over u, du. So we can get the answer 1 over 3. This one is integrate 1 over u. We get ln u and then plus c. Lastly, we substitute what is the u. So final answer we can get. 1 over 3 ln, our u now is e to the power of 3x minus 1 plus c. So that's the solution for the example 5. The question is integrate e to the power of 1 over t over t square dt. Okay, the clue is Okay, if you have this expression, if you have the E question in terms of E, the first one is you must think let U, our U, choose your U is the power of E. So if you see the power of E is 1 over T and then if we differentiate 1 over T, we can get negative 1 over T square. So now here we have the terms. Okay, that's why. Now, we can solve it using substitution, which is we choose our u is 1 over t. So, let u is equal to 1 over t. So, we differentiate with respect to t. du dt is equal to negative 1 over t square. So, now, here we have the terms. Okay, that's why... We modify, we get negative du is equal to 1 over t square dt. So, now our question now to be, we can change from t to be u. So, we can get integrate 
e to the power of 1 over t times 1 over t square dt. So, our question can be more easier because we change to expression u. So, we can get e to the power of u. And then here 1 over t square dt is negative du from here. So this one is negative du. So we solve it. Negative put outside. So integrate e to the power of u du. So we get the answer negative e to the power of u plus c. So so finally, we substitute what is our u. So we can get the answer negative e to the power of 1 over t plus c. So we get the answer. Okay, next. Okay, let we see the example 7. Example 7, find the integral of 2 plus ln x to the power of 3 over x dx. So, using the substitution method, we can see from this expression, differentiate 2 plus ln x, we can get 1 over x. Okay, that's why, now to solve it, we choose our u is in the bracket. So, let u is equal to 2 plus ln x, so, we differentiate with respect to x, we can get 1 over x. So, we modify du is equal to 1 over x dx. Our question now, okay, from here we can write 2 plus ln x to the power of 3 times 1 over x dx. So, using substitution just now, our question can change to B. This one is our U. So, we can get U to the power of 3. This one is 1 over X. DX is our DU. So, now, our question can be, okay, U to the power of 3 DU. So, we solve it. Integrate with respect to U. We get the answer u to the power of 4 over 4 plus c. One more time, lastly, don't forget to substitute what is our u. So, we get the answer 2 plus ln x to the power of 4 over 4 plus c. Okay. Let me see the next example, example 8. Find the integration of 3x plus 5, 3rd x plus 1 dx. By using substitution method, we must choose our u is in the third. Okay, now let me see the solution is, let u is equal to x plus 1. So, the, the next step is we differentiate with respect to x. So, we can get du dx is equal to 1. So, now our question is now we have this one is dx. Okay, so du is equal to dx. Okay, so to change our question in the terms of u. So, no, now from here we can change to be integrate 3. So, now we must think this now is x. So, from the substitution, we have x as a subject. So, x is equal to u minus 1. So, substitute into the question x with the u minus 1 plus 5 and then this one is third, this one our u and then dx is du. So, Expand the expression so we can get 3u minus 3 plus 5. This one we can write u to the power of 1 over 2 
this one is du. So, we simplify, we can get 3u plus 2 and then this one is u to the power of 1 over 2 du. The next step is to solve it, we must expand so we can get the integration 3u plus 2 and then this one is u to the power of 1 over 2 du. We expand. We get 3u to the power of 3 over 2 plus this one is 2u to the power of 1 over 2 du. Now we can integrate directly because this one is plus. So we can get 3u to the power of 5 over 2 over 5 over 2 plus 2u to the power of 3 over 2 over 3 over 2 plus c. So simplify so we can get 6 over 5 u to the power of 5 over 2 plus 4 over 3 u to the power of 3 over 2 plus c. Lastly, okay, we can simplify it, factorize okay, the terms so we can get u to the power of 3 over 2, we put outside, okay, we factorize. So, here we can get 6 over 5 and then this one is, we can get u, this one is plus, this one is 4 over 3 plus c. And then, one more time, we substitute. Okay, the finally substitute what is our u. Our u just now is x plus 1. So, we can get this answer. Okay, and then this one is 6 over 5. This one is x plus 1 plus 4 over 3 plus c. Okay, the final answer you can stop here or also you can simplify and simplify in the bracket. Okay, so we get the answer for the example A.